All right, so as you can see, we have the April crew pack reveal. And her name is Sayara. So I think that's how you say that. I'm really not sure. I usually try to look up the pronunciations before I do a video so I don't make myself look like a fool. But I cannot find any pronunciation of this that's the same as another. Some people say Sayara. Some people say Sayara. I don't know. Someone let me know in the comments how this is actually pronounced because no two pronunciations that I listened to were identical. So I'm not sure. Regardless, it's a girl though. At first I thought this was a guy, but it says she's always watching, coming soon in the April crew pack. So let's read the official Fortnite blog and see if there's anything interesting with this pack. It says her face may be covered, but she's always watching. Though hooded and masked, Sayara is unhindered in the April 2022 crew pack. This crew pack goes live for active Fortnite crew subscribers at approximately 8 p.m. on March 31st. In addition to the Sayara outfit, the April crew pack contains the following items. The fangs of Sayara back bling, a back bling holding two blades, the dual machetes pickaxe, no hands idle with this dual wield pickaxe, and then the Sayara sight wrap. And that's about all they say. So I'm not going to lie. This looks a little disappointing. We've got dual wielded pickaxes. We've got a pretty bland back bling. The wrap looks okay. I mean, it's got a nice color scheme at least. We don't know if it's reactive or animated yet. And the skin, I don't know. I feel like we've had multiple skins like this before. At first, I thought it was a cat. And in fact, I don't know if it's not a cat. It could be a fox. I don't know. It's got ears, but at the start of the trailer, she was doing the Meowsel's cat emote. So I'm assuming it's a cat. And if that's the case, we've had Lynx, we've had Vix, we've had multiple cat-like characters in Fortnite before. So in that regard, it's kind of repetitive. And then I saw people complaining that we've had too many female skins in the crew pack. I think we've had six male characters and over 10 females. Now, I prefer running female characters in Fortnite just because they're more sleek and slender. But a lot of people like running males. And in that regard, we're kind of outnumbered in the crew pack. And yet we have another female here. It's like month three or four in a row. So other than the amazing color scheme, which again, I think is perfect, that black and pink, I love those colors. Other than that though, there does not appear to be any redeeming qualities. Now, I would assume it would have showed us if she would have had more styles, but it doesn't show any. And we don't know if anything's reactive or animated at least. So we're gonna hold on tight on our official review until we see a little bit more. But right now, this is a little underwhelming. The best part about this entire reveal is that in the trailer, it showed her using the LMG, one of my favorite weapons in the game. If you look at some of the crew skins in the past, again, you just feel a little underwhelmed here. Remember Deimos? That skin had three styles and it included a Spotify premium membership plus Save the World. Or what about when we had Midas's troops? Remember when he formed that army of three? If you collected all of them, you got an exclusive style for all three. And then we've got this skin with no other styles. And again, like I said, no redeeming qualities that I can see. Now, of course, to each their own. Again, this may look awesome in game. We'll just have to wait and see. But it just appears to be a little underwhelming at first glance. So there you go. When we can access her in the Fortnite crew tab, I'll do a little mini review. But right now you can't. If I go down there, I still think we're seeing Miss Tracy Trouble. Yes. And a lot of people hated this skin too. I think this is one of the better ones we've ever had, to be honest. Well, there you go. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter credit code, which is TaberTime.